But coming up next, we have the final for the women's 400 meter hurdles. Looking at the lane draw for the women's 400 meter hurdle final, Elmerie van Grenen lines up in lane number two representing the University of Pretoria. Twanet University of Technology is represented by Giselle Marchemann. She is in lane at number three. Taylor Bilt, she just ran a PB in the 100 meter hurdles. She lines up in lane number four. Zene van der Walt on the outside. She's already qualified for the World Champions coming up later on this year in the 400 flat as well as the 400 hurdles. Rogel Joseph lines up in lane number six, also a phenomenal 400 meter hurdler. She is representing the Northwest University of Potterstrom. Anya Nell in lane number seven from the University of Pretoria. And closing it off is Simone De Vet from the University of Pretoria. Phenomenal lineup there. Are they gonna produce? Team start here for our athletes. Who's gonna go out hard? It is a neighbor in the vault that goes out hard. But Taylor Bilt, who just ran a PB and a university record, also chasing Zane down from lane number four. Will Taylor be able to close that stagger? Zane is, is running really well, but also on the outside, Regal Joseph running well and keeping up with the stagger. It is the three of those athletes. Giselle Markerman just sitting behind them, not really uh, excited to run a fast first 200 meters. But it is Taylor Bilt at the moment coming through with the speed around that 200 meter bend. Who's it gonna be? Will Zanay be able to catch and hold on to Taylor Bilt or is Taylor Bilt going to take this one? She has just come off a massive PB and record and qualification in the 100 meters and will that give her that confidence to perform well here on the 400 meters? It is going to be a battle between Taylor Bilt and Zanay van der Valt. Can Zanay catch her? Is Taylor going to take it? This is going to go down to the wire. We see that endurance coming through of Zanay van der Valt and she just opens her stride, executes this race beautifully and the victory belongs to Zanay van der Valt. 55.76 followed by Taylor Bilt. Well done to our ladies. I mean, Taylor had to go out hard. We know that Zanae van der Valt has the endurance at the end. We know that she can execute. So Taylor tried to separate herself from Zanae van der Valt. But Zanae just hung on because she knows where her strength lies. And that is important when it comes to an elite Taylor went out hard. You know? She decided, she said, let me go out here. Mm -hmm. Let me run the race yeah. and just hold on and see if she can catch me. Looking at the results for the women's hurdles, we have... Zanae van der Valt with the victory in a time of 55.75 seconds coming through. In second place with a phenomenal run there, Taylor Bilt in a time of 56.33. And getting the third place, Rogel Joseph in a time of 58.56 seconds.